Hey everyone, today I'm going to quickly show you a new update I have been working on. I have added something that makes hiding other apps during screen sharing much easier and more reliable. Previously, I was using a method that involved opening external blank window to hide apps. Like if you wanted to keep your note or let's say Microsoft Word app hidden during a Zoom call, it kind of worked, but it was buggy. Some apps didn't behave well because we were opening the app inside another window right and lots of app didn't work well in this method and were pretty limited so i've completely scraped that approach and built a new method from the grounds up this one uses an os level display server inject injection yeah sounds a bit technical but the result is simple you can now hide any app from screen sharing tools like zoom teams or and it just works and i'm going to show you a quick demo now let me start my app and as you can see my app is started but you cannot see this yet let me unhide my app so that you can see the app and as you can see i have unhide the app and you can see in the screen and i have also opened a google meet for me to understand that if, if it's working or not and also show you that it works in meeting app as well i have got this excel file for you which i will be using as an example to show and i'm going to hide this from my screen recording app and is also going to be hidden from the screen sharing of google meet first we have to go, go to hide other apps and search our app that we want to hide in our case which is excel and here is the excel file i guess it's somewhere yeah this one and when i click click on hide you're gonna see it's completely hidden from the screen see it's gone but i can see this but the viewer side you cannot see the app when I click on unhide, it's going to be back again. Like both of us can see this. The only small downside route right now is that app logo still shows in the taskbar. That's a constraint from this method. It's not like our electron based app where we can control everything, but I'm actively looking for a workaround and stay tuned. More improvements are on the way and we have added, uh, going to add new non AI stuff as well. So. I'm pretty stoked to show the 